Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to be doing, as you can see behind me, an unboxing. And what that means is there's obviously another guitar here. And this one I couldn't help uh, but see what was involved here. Now I um, gave this, uh, this was one of my heads up deals uh, a couple of days ago on Amazon and was very curious. The, uh, the merchant or merchant, the, the seller, is a company called Austin Bazaar. And they listed basically two guitars for $149.99. One of them was a Daphne Blue <coughs> Strat, excuse me, Strat uh, guitar, Squire Strat, with uh, the small headstock. And the other one was a Surf Green Strat with a large headstock and looked very suspiciously like an Affinity for $149.99 advertised with a gig bag and some accessories. So, me being the person that I am and having the gas that I have, I couldn't stop myself and hold back from ordering this thing, so I did, and it's behind me. Now we will find out, and that's why I'm doing the unboxing, if in fact this is an Affinity, or if it's a debut, or if it's some other guitar. Uh, the picture looks like an Affinity, and we will go over what an Affinity has on it when I open the box. But, guys, right out of the chute, there's, no, there's not going to be any playing, no demo here. This is a first impression, did I get what I ordered video. And then I'll come back if I decide to keep the guitar um, with a demo of the guitar. Okay? So, full disclosure, no playing here. We're just going to see what's inside this box. All right, guys. Here's my knife. And it shipped like this uh, in a Squire box. Um, this I don't like. <laughs> but, you know, when you get these things shipped from Amazon, you always have issues, right? You have to have something. But, uh, yeah, this was right through the box. Right through the box, this uh, little ding here, or little rip. Um, but let's see what's in it. If it's a brand new guitar, if it's what was advertised, if it's the same color, we'll, we'll see all that in a second. Okay. I don't like single box shipments, but again, that's typically what you get these days. Uh, huh. Leave that there. Interesting already. Now this gig bag I can tell is going to be a dust cover because it's the guitar is not even in the gig bag. It's shoved in the box. So this is the gig bag. Let's take a look at what this thing is first off. All right. It's, it's a little bit better than a vinyl plastic one. This seems like a cloth, a cloth gig bag. Let's see if it has any protection in it whatsoever. Um, very thin, very thin. Yeah, no, it doesn't have any protection in it. But you know what? It'll serve the role of protecting the guitar from dust, right? It's a dust cover. Uh, I wouldn't recommend this for traveling <laughs> if you're a gigging musician. But as a dust cover to store your guitar, it's okay. It's a gig bag. It's better than nothing. Now, let's see what's in the in the box here. in the box no there's the guitar okay so fender card for free lessons or something else they're given here uh, looks like let's see do you get any free online lessons free digital tuner hmm. free gift if you scan this, I, I don't know what you actually get, but okay. 
Then you have an Austin Bazaar. Little uh, instructional video in here. And uh, a very, very cheap digital tuner. Gear Lux digital tuner. Okay, but again, it's better than nothing, right? And you get your Squire manual here, which is nice and warranty. The whammy bar. And a couple of tools to, to adjust the neck. So that's good. You're getting everything with the guitar. Pardon me for that adjustment of the uh, focus on the camera there. Okay, uh, this is not a large headstock right out of the chute. So that's not good because the picture clearly showed a guitar with a large headstock. Um, Cut this. That out. Hmm. Not coming off as, as easy as I thought it would. Okay. It's a nice looking color. Uh, it is a satin finish. Doesn't have any sparkle as it kind of described in the uh, in the picture. Um, it has a uh, well, satiny type neck, I guess, on here. Uh, not a two point trim that the picture shows. Okay. So here, a couple of things already, guys, on this that was misleading right out of the chute, right? On this guitar. Shows a big headstock in this color, the surf green, which is what I ordered, with gold on the headstock, meaning that it is more than likely a Squire Affinity, right? Had the big headstock with the big strat letters across the headstock. This is clearly a small headstock that is a bullet-like, sonic-like, debut-style Headstock. It's actually a debut, I can tell you right now, because it has the Squire um, outline not filled in on the uh, logo. So this is a debut, this guitar. It also has a matte finish, leading me to believe that it's a debut. Doesn't have a skunk stripe on it. That was shown in the picture of the guitar in the photo on Amazon. Um, it's a 24 build. It's made in China. Uh, it has a crack. <laughs> a stress crack in the neck here has another uh, no no stress crack here just on that side I don't know if you could see it or not um, can't see it in this camera it does have a stress crack uh, yeah so yeah right out of the shoot issues with the guitar now I'm not blaming it on Austin Bazaar um, although they are the merchant on Amazon that's selling this thing but I'll contact them, and I'll let you guys know how I make out, because this is not what I ordered. Um, not in the picture. Different from what Amazon had. Not what I ordered. Uh, what else? I'm trying to think here. Uh, there's not much else to say, guys. So, what this is, and I'm going to stop you. Uh, I, I think they took the ad off, um, off of Amazon. So, I don't even think this option is on Amazon anymore. They removed it. And it's a good thing they did because they might have had some complaints prior to me that it wasn't what was advertised. What they showed on the website was clearly an Affinity Strat. Two-point trim. It had the skunk stripe. It had the large headstock. Um, it had the, the gold embossed uh, logo on it. It was a completely different thing than what this guitar is. This guitar is just a normal, everyday Squire debut. They sell them for $119.99 on Amazon. So I don't know why you would pay $149.99 for this. Certainly this is not worth the extra $30. It's not a $30 worth gig bag. And this that they throw in 
um, you can probably get for less than five bucks on Amazon this digital tuner. So not worth it for what for what they shipped with this guitar. So guys, that's the deal with this uh, uh, whatever it is debut uh, that now the mystery has been solved that they advertised on Amazon. See, so when something looks too good to be true, it typically is too good to be true. Uh, if you have any questions, guys, put them in the comments. Uh, if you like these videos, please subscribe. I always buy these things on my own dime so that you don't have to buy them, right? Um, this is not a, a sponsored video. I per paid for this out of my own, uh, you know, wallet and uh, hopefully prevent you in the future from falling into the same traps that I do. But yeah, guys, if you like these videos, please subscribe. And until the next time, be well. Take care.